Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla TV. We can watch, decide, and ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Cortex Super 2.0 tank bag system available at Revzilla.com. From Cortec, this is the Super 2.0. Nice step up in functionality over their micro series of tank bags, but not as streamlined or sexy as their driver series. These bad boys start at the $65 mark and they're gonna go up over that $100 mark. Now, when you look at it, you have a few options here. You have three sizes available, eight liter, 12 liter, or 18 liter. This is a 12 I have in front of me. This is 18 I have to my left. This eight liter is gonna be a little bit smaller and there are some nuanced differences between the same, but basically they're very similar. You have your map pocket, you have your interior guts. They're going to be 1680 ballistic nylon in their construction. And for each one, you have two mounting options. Now, in front of me, I have my 12 liter magnetic option. Right down there, you're going to notice if you have a metallic tank, if you have the magnetic tank option, or if you want to go with the magnetic tank option, this would be a great fit. There's also a strap mount option. To my left, this is actually a strap mount on an 18, and inside you're going to have the pad and the universal straps to connect it to your bike. Again, you have those choices depending on the direction you want to go. There's also a different mount kit for a slope version for some of the more aggressive sport bike options. Now, if you think through the driver, which also lives in the line, the key difference with that driver line, which is a step up in that $170 range, is going to have a ring mount system to go around your gas cap. Keep that in mind. Now, looking at the guts here, if I turn it to its side, you're going to see it's low profile, it's streamlined, you have your map pocket. If I open it up, you're going to notice here's my main connection zipper. Open this bad boy up. And remember, this is my magnetic version I have in front of me. You're going to see it's a fleecy red interior with some organization. You see the organization up across the top, your fleecy red towards the bottom. You're going to have some cargo netting on the inside, but again, it's very, very basic. Now on the 18, you're gonna get an extra shield case that goes inside. You also have the ability to have a hydration system work in that, and then the smaller version, that eight's gonna be a little bit more succinct. If you look at the top, you're going to notice it's a removable map pocket. So waterproof, Velcro, great if you wanna take it off, you're walking into the gas station saying, hey, where the hell am I? This is gonna come in really, really handy, and remember, it is waterproof. Notice too, on both of these, there's gonna be a good deal of reflectivity. On the front, on both sides, you're going to have this grommet where you can put your iPad or your iPod rather, run your headphones out. There's also a secondary grommet on this bad boy. You're going to see it right on the side here. That's where your hydration system would come out of here on the bigger 18 liter version. And notice the reflectivity is going to keep it another, it's going to add that subtle amount of safety that's going to bake in depending on if you're riding, if you're commuting, if you're commuting to work. The other thing I love about what they've done here on the Super 2.0 is that they've given you the ability to have this rain fly in, on the interior. The whole bag is water resistant, but when you pull out the integrated rain fly and place it on top, now you're waterproofing it. Some of the lesser expensive tank bags that I've seen, both from Cortex and others, they don't have that option. And I find for especially someone that needs at, at a minimum eight to 12 liters of additional storage on their bite, most times you're multi-season touring, you're commuting to work, you're gonna get caught in a cloudburst. With regard to installation, these are a one out of a one to three scale. Three is you better really know your way around the bike. Two is I need a set of full tools and I need a buddy to help me out. One is I can probably do it in under an hour on my own with simple instructions that come out of the box. Whether you're magnetic or whether you're strap mount, you should be good to go. Last order of business are some of the ergonomic carry features that are worked into the Super 2.0. You're going to notice the beefy strap at the top of both units. And then if I lift it up like this on the 12 liter and 18 liter version, you actually have backpack straps that are integrated. So if you want to throw it over the shoulder, throw your camera in it. If you're rocking around town, headed off for lunch on a short jaunt, you should be covered. So the next order of business is to click right here, read other rider reviews of the Cortex Super 2.0, both magnetic and strap mount options at revzilla.com. Keep in mind, it's over 40 bucks. We're gonna ship it for free. And you do have a few different flavors here in sizes as well as mounting options. If you have any questions, shoot us a line, see us at revzilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown. I'm Anthony, we'll see you next time.